I'm just round here in Pinay Bay today and uh, it's a lovely sunny day to look for fossils along the Jurassic coast and uh, I'm going to set out and try and find some fossil sea urchins, some Arneoceros blocks and just see what I can find as I go down off through into Pinay Bay looking for the fossil finds. I'm really pleased, I just found a really nice sea urchin fossil find on the beach and uh, it's preserved in flint rock. This specimen here from the Cretaceous age, a uh, really nice one. I'm going to just give it a tap and uh, try and get that out of the rock. I'll just uh, get my sunglasses out of my pocket and put those on. Plenty of one-eyed geologists for not wearing uh, their safety spectacles or some sort of protective eyewear. So. Uh, Here's the specimen, I'll just give that a real sharp tap. That's it, that's released it out of the out of the rock. There's the impression one side, the whole fossil sea urchin, the other side. 130 million year old sea urchin from the Cretaceous age in the sun there. I've got some uh, spines on still preserved on that piece of flint rock. I just found this block of Arneoceros ammonites from the Jurassic age. Quite a nice uh, calcite ammonite on the top there, worn down by the attrition of the sand and sea. So I'm gonna have a tap at this rock, see what's in it, and try and get it to break right down through the middle there. You can see some nice ammonites there from the Jurassic, some nice ammonites round down by the attrition of the sand and sea. I've just got my uh, sunglasses on today to protect my eyes from uh, because I split down through this specimen. So I shall uh, give a good tap with a hammer and see what I can split out of this uh, particular rock. I've got the uh, nice hickory handled hammer to do the splitting with. So I'll get a really good sharp crack with the hammer and uh, split down through this uh, Arneoceros bodily block. That's going right down through the middle. This should be quite a nice block of the Arneoceros ammonites from the Jurassic Age. There's a lovely one there from 190 million years ago. First time it's seen the light of day in all those millions of years. That's a really nice one to take back and do the preparation of. Fossil ammonites from the Jurassic Age. I'm lucky enough to have found a nice little cobble of the uh, ammonites in this uh, particular limestone rock. You can see here with the uh, nodule quite a few ground down by the attrition of the sand and sea on the outside. To give the game away there might be something more on the inside. So I've got my hickory handled hammer and uh, it's quite a hard rock to break through but I'll have a go at this. Sturdy gloves I recommend as well when breaking this uh, right rock. A bit of the outside material just fell off. Give it a crack with a hammer. See if I can uh, split the fossil out along the line of weakness, which should be the fossil inside that rock. So let's give it a really good crack with this cleave end of the hammer. There we go. That's induced the crack. I'll just put some seawater in through the crack. So when it opens up, this should be a really nice ammonite from the Jurassic, 190 million year old ammonite, the first time it's seen the light of the day in all those millions of years, a nice prehistoric fossil find. I'm pleased with that one, that's a good fossil there, cleaved with this hickory handled hammer. Beautiful sunny evening here in Pinay Bay to come round 
to this point I love to see the moss waterfall and uh, I always love walking up to this uh, particular section and today you can see as the sun starts to go down you can see the sun shining through that waterfall up ahead a beautiful section of the Jurassic coast where the moss waterfall crashed down onto the shoreline and uh, now the sea is eroding it away down here is where you'll see some of it start to rejuvenate itself higher up where the water's pouring through it and hopefully we'll have a complete moss waterfall again someday in this uh, beautiful neck of the woods round through in Pinay Bay we are today please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the thumbs up button if you like this particular fossil collecting video I made. There's the beautiful Jurassic Coast, really lovely calm day and that there is the remnants of the moss waterfall on the beach now having fallen down in a gale. If you look up there nature is finding a way and the moss is starting to grow back again. An absolute beautiful sight to see here along the Jurassic Coast.